hi guys and welcome back to another video obviously telling by the title you know your sis had to come back with a story time as you can tell by the title the time me and my sister got into a fight in a nightclub on holiday only we would do that why i don't know but let's get into it December 2017 um, I went on holiday to Uganda this was kind of the year where we were like you know what we're actually going to take advantage of the time we're there and actually go out to see what Uganda's like because normally when we go there we like we go around with my mum like we go wherever she goes what she does because we're like scared we're like usios like we don't want to like do anything on our own like because obviously if you're from Africa you know and you live here it's like it's it's different so this year we we're like yeah I boom we're gonna go we're gonna get lit we're gonna turn up what now what not okay so we were there whatever whatever so I have a cousin that lives there he lived there for like quite a while he used to live here so he lives there now so he was like oh guys like let's go out so he's like yeah I know a club that we can go to so we're thinking all right cool yeah so I was 18, my sister was 22 at the time. But he's like, okay, uh, let's go Club Cayenne. I think that's how you say it. If you're Ugandan and you're watching this, I don't know how you guys say it, but I'm going to say it how I think you should say it. Club Cayenne. We've met his friend, Rakia. Shout out to you. Got in the cab. We're there. Checking our ID. Sorted. All good. In the party. Boom. We've walked in now. And I've never seen a club like this in my life. Like... The club was so big, like, I'm thinking, is this, like, a school? Like, seriously. So we walked in, there's, like, a dance floor. You walk around, there's, like, a room, that's a bar or something. This is how I remember it. I don't know if they've changed it now. There's, like, a bar, and then you walk around, there's, like, a sh outside, there's, like, a shisha spot, like, literally just an area for shisha. And then there's literally a swimming pool, like, a big swimming pool. And then behind the swimming pool, there's, like, a DJ booth. So I'm thinking, wow, yeah, we're going to get lit. This is so lit. Oh, my God, yeah. Yeah, all right. So we've gone in now, and then we're trying to find a spot. So you know how you're in a rave or a party, and, like, you just rotate because you just want to find, like, a certified, you know, spot to chill, you know, to vibe. We found a little spot. We've spotted my cousin's friends. So, you know, we've got a little sodas, you know, the soda, yeah, 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 shout out to my gang, that know the soda, soda, soda. My favourite soda is Novido. I swear that, that drink, I'm going to put it here so you guys can see how it looks like. This drink is the bomb.com. Okay, cool. So, we've got our little drinks, we're drinking, whatever. So, it's like, it's been a couple of hours, it's been a couple of minutes, minutes, minutes have gone by hours have gone by we're lit we're dancing duh, 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 duh. so my it's like late now and my cousin's spotted someone because he's moving a bit paro so i'm thinking what's going on like what's going on so he's like guys we need to leave so i'm looking at my sister like She's looking at me like, everyone's just there like, okay, like why? He's a, he's a hiding while he's saying this. He's like, guys, we need to leave, like my ex is there. So I'm thinking, don't nobody care about your ex? Like, I don't care, like, what's that got to do with me? I'm out here trying to catch a vibe, trying to be lit. You're telling me your ex is here. I'm thinking, all right. He's moving booky. I'm thinking, brother, like, what's happening? He's like, let's go. Like, I'm thinking, all right, calm down. So, all right, we're like, cool, right, let's go, like, so we're walking, we're walking, you know, minding our business. So, as I said to you, we're out with a friend. So, it was four of us. So, Rakia's in the front, um, I think I was behind her, yeah, and then my sister was behind me, and then my cousin was behind me, because, like, he's thinking, let me just follow behind them, just in case anything happens, as a man should, you know. So, we're walking, all I see is him just getting dragged by his hand like literally i'm thinking oh what's going on i'm thinking what is happening please tell me why it's the girl she's literally ran across this big club like the club was big obviously if you're ugandan and you're watching this you know how big that club is i couldn't believe it because it's like it's like she literally grabbed him like this so i'm thinking oh 
so we stopped so now we're inside the building like near the dance floor ish so the girl was like oh don't leave me she's intoxicated just to put it just to throw it out so we're good like we're proper like what so she's like don't leave me like i love you she's saying this in luganda because basically she's kenyan but i think she lives there I don't know that's what i heard in it she's like oh don't leave me like i love you this and now why did you leave me like you know we're meant for each other so she's saying bare things like can you imagine this is your ex of how many i don't know i think it was i don't know they broke up quite a while ago and it's like you're coming out of nowhere like anyway so i'm thinking what so we're trying to leave so my sister's like my sister's starting to get annoyed because she's thinking first of all who are you first of all who are you you're touching up my cousin and we don't know you from adam um you just want to come and do scrapping like so my sister's getting irate in it so we're walking my sister the girl's really hitting my cousin from the back like she's proper hitting him in there so my sister's thinking i'm not i'm not having it you see this jump i'm wearing this collar She's seen red. She's thinking, no. Mm -mm 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 -mm. She's gone up to her face. She's like, get the F out of my cousin's face. Who do you think you are hitting him like that? You're crazy. This and that. You need to get a grip. Da, da, da. My sister's getting angry. By the way, me and my sister have never met this girl. Yeah. So my sister's angry, angry. So the girl's obviously getting up in her face like, yeah, yeah, yeah. My sister's gone, bop. Back, 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 back. Yeah. Give and take. She did this boom I'm thinking what 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 just happened in those two seconds like my sister punched her the girl fell on the floor the girl fell on the floor so now we're in the middle of the dance floor yeah tell me why yeah I can't find my manita no tell me why all these hooligans in the club have made by the way that night there was a lot of people like i'm not even joking the club was so packed like i don't think and that night i don't think they were letting any more people in so obviously these ugandans made a whole circle around us they're like fight 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 so now me and my sister look around like what have we done like people pulling out their phones i'm thinking oh my god what's going on so the girls got up the girls come to start fighting my sister like she's proper like i'm thinking okay first of all you're drunk so i don't know where the energy's coming from pipe down and then um, my cousin's obviously now trying to split them up so rookie's like guys we need to get out of here like so we're walking out so we're thinking all right like the pass is done oh no dear it's not done it's not done she's running after us this crazy psycho is running after us like screaming out, i love you like who do those girls think they are like do they know who i am thinking no we don't know who you are let us know okay anyway so now we're outside of the venue because we're thinking obviously me and my sister thinking first of all we don't want to end up on bookend the news that look at these slick queens they want to just fight i'm screaming i'm thinking no that's not happening and my cousin's thinking i don't want us to get in trouble i don't want your mom to be thinking like you can't look after my girls when they're out so we're outside the girl's following us the girl's shouting like now she's trying to fight like me well everyone she's trying to fight everyone so i'm thinking so she's now she's still hitting my cousin guys because my cousin was basically the the barrier between her and me and the girls me and my sister Rokia. so she's getting angry in it because she's seeing her man with girls because obviously she doesn't know where his cousin so she's probably thinking right like he's leaving the club with girls in front of my face because obviously like if you see your ex leaving the club with girls you're gonna like feel some type of way i wouldn't personally but everyone you know everyone's boat floats different so so now i'm starting to get angry like she's proper i'm proper like get so i start to get involved i'm thinking who do you think you are you need to leave us alone you look crazy like he's not your man anymore so this is me saying this stuff he's not your man anymore duh, 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 duh. so the girls run up 
she don't run up she run up on me so i'm thinking whoa that night i wore a red jumpsuit no red not my favorite color i wore a red jumpsuit and sliders because obviously it's hot like whatever so i'm thinking she's running up if you went to high school with me you know i can't fight so i use my legs my legs are my be my best asset so i'm thinking i've got long legs they literally used to call me daddy long legs like okay so i'm i'm like what no i've gone and done the highest kick i could possibly do because i wanted to kick her my aim was to kick her in the chest so she can like fall so we can literally just s out like just go i've tried to kick her as i've gone to kick her my cousin wants to be bodyguard and he's held me back like this he's like shan you're not doing that calm down as i've gone to kick her my slider did this Pew. We all watched my slider fly like my slide that's how you know the kick was so the energy in that kick was powerful because it, i was angry i'm thinking you want to scrap with my sister you're hitting my cousin like what's actually going on in your head like so the slider is now missing i'm thinking no mm -mm everyone bond this fight we have to find my slider i'm out here screaming where the f is my slide where's my slider guys guys we need to find my slider or else i'm actually gonna get mad where's my slider where's my slider? my cousins are shining like we don't know where your slider is we don't know my sister's like where did you kick it i'm thinking i don't know like we need to because now i look like an idiot right i'm hopping on one leg everyone else is fighting and arguing i'm hopping on one leg trying to find a slider who told me to kick like that i don't know but there there you go shan you want to do power rangers there you go so i'm like what where's my slider like i'm starting to get upset because it was actually a really cute slider i'm not being funny and then i'm like yo like where's my slider okay cool so i found the slider in it mind you the girl is still attacking us you know she's actually still attacking us so Obviously, there must have been, like, a scary, like, for my Ugandans, that like, no, a scary. They have, like, them guns. Like, they have the guns on, on deck. Like, if they're, if they're ready, they just, like, start to pop up. Like, don't nobody want, like, I don't want none of that, innit? So, the Ascaris are there watching. They're thinking, like, what's going on? Like, so, the girl's really not, she's not tired, innit? She's followed us until where the taxis are, right? So, now, Rukia's so it was like stages so it's like my cousin beefed her in the club my sister scrapped with her in the dance floor i went and high kicked her in the car park and rakia is now basically rakia is the cuss book in it like near the taxi she's cussing so this is what obviously i'm not good at luganda as you saw from my previous video my ethnicity tag all i remember is rakia was just so angry she was saying stuff like you're crazy she's like you're not with the guy anymore who do you think you are like leave us alone she was like growing up in her face she's like obviously when ugandans cuss i find it so funny because i'm thinking they make up stuff out of nowhere so obviously Rukia's now obviously hyped up and she's getting mad. The girls now tried to like hit her and then that's when security came and decided to get involved to like go and arrest her. So basically she got arrested in the end. I'm thinking, so who really won? You did all this energy to run around the club to come and fight us for no reason for an ex. Okay then. And then you got arrested. You, you, you and yourself, you got arrested. I'm thinking, okay, dear, what now? Hmm? What now? But yeah, like that night was just crazy. After that, I'm thinking, what is happening? And then I think a couple of days later, we must have been in another like club. And I don't know, I think she was there, but she didn't see us like the whole time. So I'm thinking, Ugh, girl, we're not gonna do part two because I don't have the energy. Like, I don't fight, I'm not a fighter, but like, get a grip okay but anyway that was the story time when we got into a scrap if you like that story time just let me know if you want to hear more story times from me in the comments below make sure to like share and subscribe to my channel and i will see you in the next video